everybody and welcome back to another session of couples therapy doppelganger i almost called it okami for some reason <laughs> oh dear because we've been we i think it's because i looked at you and then i thought about us recording okami and i'm like wait that's because we were supposed to record okami on monday whoopsie Oops. i love you <laughs> so much hi <I'm> yuri <laughs> anyways because i have kleinfelter i looked exactly like a girl when i was little that's why I was shy and always played with my female friends. They always dressed me up because I was pretty. I don't deny it, I really looked like a pretty girl back then. When they first decided to make me wear a frilly dress, I went home wearing that. That's when I met my guy friends from school. Um... Sunshine, go. Hey, yes. isn't that Yuri? Okay, I'll do this again. That faggot looks like he's dressing up like a girl. Suits him. That scum. Let's kick him down. Hey, you. Yes. That frilly dress. It suits you. What a fag you are. Hey, let's take a picture of him and spread it around school. Yeah, good idea. Or can just splash him in the water first, right? Fag on him, permanent marker. You faggot. No, don't do that. that what are you gonna do, huh? Scream. Seriously, what's a boy doing looking like a girl? You suck. You know that. No! Please don't! Show that you're a guy! Can't you fight back, huh? It hurts! Come on, fight back, you weakling! I... Come on, you freak! Fight back! Damn it. Hey, stand back! Uh, uh, it's that guy again. Are you ashamed of punching a girl around like that? It's sickening! He's not... You guys need some lessons, huh? Spinning bird kick! Wow. Physically impossible maneuver! The boy wearing a cap was able to beat down all the boys that tried to hurt me. Run! Run for the hills! What's that boy anyway? There's no one who can beat the Ironmonger! <laughs> Why are you named after the Marvel villain? Because I can! Ironmonger? Hey, are you okay? Jeez, you're so dirty. Yeah. You're a dirty they, little boy, aren't what? you? What? They're yeah. like kids! <laughs> Thank you so much! Um, who is your name? <laughs> I forgot words! <laughs> I'm the Ironmonger. I fight crime and bullies. Ironmonger? Yep. What's your name? Yuri. Yuri? That's a, what a cute name. It suits you. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, I know. By the way, why were they bullying you? I felt ashamed to admit that I was a boy to him, and thought he would never believe me. I don't know. Jeez, boys should re learn to respect girls more, you know? Yeah. How about we clean you up a bit, eh? Your clothes will get a bit, a little wet, but at least they won't be as dirty. Okay. I decided to clean my clothes a little, and he waited for me. Hey, Ironmonger! Huh? <laughs> So, sorry! I want to be strong like you someday! Oh, uh, why? I don't want to get bullied in the future. I'm going to be strong like you! I see. <laughs> That's a good one, Yuri. Can you teach me how to fight? Because of my condition, they say I have weaker muscles. But if I can be fast like you... I can't. Why? I'm going to leave this country for a few years. My dad's work is forcing us to move temporarily. But don't give up! Uh... Here, I took karate lessons here. You can go there and learn if you want to be like me. Or you can try other self-defense arts there. They also teach boxing and wushu. I see. But you see, my dad told me that girls are supposed to be pretty and take care of their bodies more while men have to do all the work. So you might want to... No, I'm going to stand back and... I'm not going to stand back and watch. I'm going to make them regret bullying people like me. All the stupid boys can go to hell. <laughs> yeah, you're right. All the stupid boys can go to hell. I'm looking forward to seeing the new you when I come back. I'm looking forward to seeing you too. How am I going to recognize you? I'll know. Huh? But when we grow older, my voice will be deeper and all. <laughs> You're right. I know I'll recognize you, though, because you're the prettiest girl ever. <laughs> At any rate, 
We live under the same sky. Huh? As long as you keep using spinning bird kick, I'll recognize you in an instant. I'll keep fighting, and you will too, right? Yeah, I guess you're right. Maybe one day, when you're stronger, we'll face each other in a dojo. And when you use it, I'll know it's you. Pinky promise? Pinky promise! <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> that person who called himself Ironmonger was the one who built my self-confidence. Like he suggested, I learned how to defend myself. But that made me too proud. I kept fighting and bullying other boys instead, because I wanted revenge. I started to grow more manly, but I couldn't bring myself to hate cooking and all other womanly chores. So in the end, I put that facade on the outside. That I am a big, strong guy, but on the inside, an extra X chromosome in me won't let me pretend sometimes. Oh, wait, you want us to find that boy? Not to mention, you want us to make that boy love you. That's not it! Welcome back to the world of the living. <laughs> From the looks of it, you've already found him, huh? I know there must be a reason why you suddenly decided to follow June around. Because of spinning bird kick, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, I see. Ooh. Funny, isn't it? Back then, she pretended to be a boy, and I pretended to be a girl. I always thought that she couldn't beat him. But those moves, that kick... The way she does it, there's no mistaking it. I just knew it. <laughs> I guess I instantly fell in love at first kick. Aww. But she remembered, and she seems disappointed at me. She was... <sighs> Never mind. I'm going to help you. <laughs> Clifford's like, I'll be matchmaker today! Yes, yeah. it's my time to shine! Okay. What? No. Yeah. <laughs> she, oh my gosh, she, he wouldn't see her. So, oh, she yeah. wouldn't see him, so he could leave. Just like, oh my gosh, kiss. so literally Clifford could be the wingman. <laughs> and the time June and Yuri are hanging out, he's like, now you guys kiss. And Yuri's like, mm, Clifford! Clifford! You must kiss! And June's like, the fuck? Like, Clifford's like doing like the thing where he turns around with the arms. Yeah. Like, and, <laughs> and Yuri's just like, mm. <laughs> Poor Yuri. I said I'm gonna help you, bro. Clifford is all about other people in love. That's because I understand that feeling. The feeling of being in love. So I'm gonna help you. I guess Chong must want it as well. <laughs> because she also likes to help people. Then I'll leave it all to you. I have no time for pointless love affairs. Gosh. See you then. <laughs> Click. Wow. Well, fine, Buzzkill. <laughs> buzzkill and just Buzzkill on top. <laughs> I'm leaving! <laughs> what have I done? I'm going to help you out too, Yuri, because I love you! But June loves you more. <laughs> I'm in love with someone else anyway. June is my friend, after all. Wait, what? <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Well, so we're saving Yuri first now. I'll leave the rest to you then. Yes, yeah, since his wish is the most immediate, so... Huh? I'm going to investigate a bit more about Zhuang and Raphael. Good call. He never came back to the hospital since the Rico incident, so I'm wondering what they could be planning. I see. Good luck to you. You too. Uh, Abby, do this one. Musea! Huh? Behold! Oh my gosh! Ah! <laughs> I love it. I love it. We I get to play with the awesome Yuri! I've been waiting for us to play with the... Hi, student is standing in front of me. He seems to know me. Hi, Yuri. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> Who are you? You don't know me? I think I saw you somewhere, I, but I have no idea. Throw fruits. <laughs> oh, that's good. I can do whatever I set out to. What the heck was that? Who the heck was that? Here you go. As promised. Everyone was surprised when a guard asked a high student came in. Hey, hey, is that Garnester High's uniform? I'm surprised. Wow, what is he doing here? <laughs> well, uh, he really came. Huh? Wait a second. If he made a promise to June, then... Wait, are you? Yari! Now I can understand why he said he 
was originally like a girl. I can I can mistake him to uh, be a female model anywhere. No, no, I can see it. Mm -hmm. Shut up! Don't tell anyone, okay? I'm not wearing makeup today, so shush. Okay, maybe he can make a living as those guys who dress up like female singers. Well, he has a different goal in mind. <laughs> you really looked like your old self. Still pretty. Yeah, anyway, here you go. I don't know what you like, so I cooked lasagna. I love lasagna. Hold it. How do I know this isn't poison? <laughs> June, are you go? You'll go that far? Why would I poison you? June raised his shoulders a bit and continued to stare at him uh, teasingly. I should have been. Except maybe putting some love potion or whatnot in it, but I'm not such a wuss to use that kind of trick. I gotta go. <laughs> when Yuri starts to turn back, June starts to turn back. June pokes his back. Seriously, this is embarrassing. I've done it all right. Try to consider something. Wait, what? June's dating a girl? You idiot, that's a guy! But he has to be a pre, alright! Now that I think of it, they fit really well. I can't believe you really came! Thanks, I love lasagna! Uh, but what? Uh, do, hmm. Don't be late to school, okay? Y yeah, I'll try. Why do I see Yuri as a girl in love with June as the boy? This is so reversed, which is why I ship it! Yes! But then again, it was what happened back then, too. Well, mm, <laughs> mm, so, what do I get in return? Can I walk you to school or something? We are in the school. B because it'll be easier for me to give you another one tomorrow. You like pasta? This is pasta. What different kind of pasta? Mm, no, I guess not. Oh. Joan looks kind of guilty to see Yuri so down. So I finally shake her head. She uh, so I finally she shake fi her head. <laughs> I try up! So she finally shakes her head and speaks again. I'll see you after school, though. I'm not wasting this washing. I'm not watching this lunchbox, you know? This bento's gonna be fucking dirty! Yep! Just gonna rub it into the baseball field a little bit. <laughs> yep. Besides, I like a particular brand of ice cream. If I buy you some, think you can make the same flavor? Yeah. I'll see you later then. Yuri, I guess he's better off this way. He looked so happy, right? Yes. If it wasn't for me. John. Seems like he really grew stronger. Well, I kept keep chasing something I can't achieve. Don't wish, mm -hmm. child, I swear. Don't wish. Don't wish. Oh, please. Never mind. <laughs> she wishes. <laughs> oh, no. I June wish. and Yuri left. It was precious. Well, at this point, I have to leave it all to Yuri. I yeah, hope everything Clifford. went well. Clifford just oh, so slowly, it. like, forces the hands. Take it there. Panicky. <laughs> and Yuri the whole time is like, ah! <laughs> like, Clifford really grabs his hand. Clifford! No, I can just imagine. <laughs> so Yuri sees Clifford moving his hand, but June doesn't see Clifford. And so Yuri is just screaming at his hand, being like, ah! And he's going to reach and grab it. And he's just like, what just happened? <laughs> I can try to be concerned! Anyway, we'll see ya. Um, I heard Neo call me f call, call me from behind. That's not what I wanted, but thank you. Hello. I turned and there he was, waving his, uh, <laughs> Game of Boy. Game, Game of Boy! Game of Boy! Time to play Sun and Moon! <laughs> hey! No, it would be playing Red Shh, and Blue. Sun and Moon. What do you want? Wow, that hurts. Yeah, I was about to say the same thing. <laughs> All right, what's up? I wanted to report you what I discovered today, you see. Cool. Oh, jeez, he's back in his puppy dog mode again. Puppies! And that would be... I won't tell you if you don't want to come with me. Kidnapping? You're going to kidnap me? Right, and your parents will pay for this. Oh, gee. Oh my goodness. No, oh, no. What am I? What am I gonna do? It's so playful and cute, dude. <laughs> you know what? How this... long until it goes to crap? <laughs> you know what? This kind of reminds me of my like. There was a police. There's actually several police officers who lived in my ward growing up, and my dad kept trying to say, "Oh, you should get the police officer friends to arrest your prom dates to ask them out." I'm like, no, nope. that's not funny. Oh, that's terrifying. Yeah, only if they've been like dating you for a long time. 
Mm. Maybe. Maybe. It depends on the people. Yeah. Mm. I, I could see me totally be cool with it because would, he would probably ask my uncle specifically to arrest me. <laughs> <laughs> and then it'd be fine. Yeah. I'd be like, what are we doing? Uncle Ned? Uncle Ned? Uncle Ned? Uncle Ned! Ned! We're going to Japan! Oh, come on! <laughs> yeah, car ride! Right. Let's eat first. Eat in a moving car. Yes! Don't worry. I asked permission from your parents and promised that you'll be back before 7.45 p.m. What did you say to them that made them that made them allow you to? Holy stuff. The fact that I'm a gentleman and will protect you from everything that moves and shoots needles. Oddly Are you talking specific. about cactar? Shh. <laughs> right, right. And afterwards, we'll go to the game center. Yeah! What cool fish? Game center, you're tracking me, aren't Tricking. you? Tricking. Tricking me, aren't you? No! After that, we'll talk about the case. It's called a date, damn it! Dang it, what? You're so carefree. I worked hard, so I deserve a nice season being with a beautiful lady. <laughs> nice, try. So <laughs> nice try. I love it so much! Nice try, Neo. Nice try. Sorry, I keep interrupting you. No, you're I'm good. excited. Okay, so I'm going to order a burger. Yeah. Burger? You come all this... You come all the way here and you're ordering a burger? Yep, burger? donuts and burgers. <laughs> oh, cool! That sounds like a horror, actually. Yeah. Oh. No. There was a restaurant I saw once that they had a burger, but the buns were donuts. Yeah, yeah. it's disgusting. I uh, know, it was just like, oh dear. Are you trying to kill yourself? Get something health get some healthy food. In five years' time, you'll end up obese. Hey, I pay for my own food, lady, so I'm gonna buy the stuff that's cheapest and tastiest, and there's nothing you can do about it. <laughs> that's not the way you do it. You need to eat vegetables, too. Screw you, Lucia! Give it up. You could learn a thing or two from Lucia, honey. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> she right clicked. She right clicked to get away from the situation. Actively, <laughs> I need to actually accidentally bang the mouse against yeah. the chair, <laughs> trying to flee my husband. No, no, <laughs> so, uh, no. It's Anthony. Oh my gosh, it is. <laughs> I can't waste the lives of animals who have died making this either. They are better off in someone's stomach now that they have turned into this. <laughs> can't let them rot away in the trash now, can we? The thrash. The thrash. The thrash. The thrash. <laughs> what is that way of thinking? The I best know? way of thinking. Anyway, I'm going to pay for my own food, so eat those veg. So, okay. A gentleman must always pay for a lady's food. You're the one who asked me here. I decide whether or not to pay or not. In this particular case, I'm paying. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she's not fun at all. Usually girls will go blush and say, Senpai. Oh, Mr. Neo. Oh. Yeah, blush. Oh, senpai. senpai. Senpai swoon. Senpai swoon. <laughs> or something to that extent. Yeah, you wish. Don't wish. Don't wish. Anyway, how long I'm, have... I'm aware. <laughs> how long have you eaten unhealthy food? Because it hasn't done anything to your ass. For oh. most of my pathetic mortal life, I guess. It's a good workout. Sheesh. <laughs> Here, have some. Uh, I think... Thank you, Abe. Hey, beautiful. Now, can I put it directly? Now, can you put it directly in my mouth? Okay, how is this keep, you know, not trying? Oh, boy. Huh? It's so cute. <laughs> All right, let me choke it down your throat and make you slowly taste the pain. The pain! The pain! <laughs> oh, my gosh, you see that? He's into that shit. It's his king. Oh, my gosh. Oh, wow. Please be gentle, mistress. This is my first time. I'm not ready yet. Oh, my God. <laughs> It is his king! Calm down, she's still in high school! <laughs> Holy, well, I guess he had to have some <laughs> There's Lucia. Somewhere. Lucia's been our reaction this whole time. <laughs> no! You're a pervert! What were you thinking? <laughs> <laughs> Usually it's the pervert who thinks of it as perverted, you pervy lady. Oh my gosh. I love it. I do too! Okay. It's such a natural conversation, even though it's, it's kind of dorky. It is! But I love it because yeah. it is. You win, but only this time. You know that dirty joke sounds like something we would make accidentally while playing. Exactly. Yeah. Okay, open your mouth and say. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, new scene! This is the game guy, Sunshine. Take it. Game of bed. Ah, oh, Neo. Long time no coming here. You okay? Oh, is that your girlfriend? Oh my gosh, why? Right? I feel like a very racist Japanese man. <laughs> I thought it was like gay. Oh, oh, like it, a racist gay. Japanese gay man. Oh uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> but soon to be. <laughs> nice. <laughs> He's gonna die. Oh dear. Okay, I, I gotta find a new so position. <laughs> 
I'm just gonna let our reactions speak for themselves. That's <laughs> chill. This is Greg, my friend. Yay, Greg! You have friends. Yes! Not, Not much, Greg. but I do! I'm Lucia. Nice to meet ya. Huh, I don't know why he likes younger ones now. Huh? I haven't seen you for five freaking years. How you doing, man? You haven't visited your game shop in like five years? I've been busy. Oh my gosh, it's getting worse. It is. But Game of Boy. Dude, I'm a cop now. Haven't you heard? I don't believe a word they said, but it seems like they're right. Girl, this guy could have been, could have had his ass arrested back then with just a single look. He looked like a criminal. <laughs> huh? What? Yeah, he smoked. He got himself tats. Oh, um, I had a very bad time after my dad died. Jeez, thanks a lot for ruining my image. Anything for you, bro. <laughs> no, wink, the, wink. No, the Lee family ruined your image. Oh. I mean, you're not wrong. Yeah. <laughs> we decide to play a shooting game. It was like our first game in the arcade. Yep. Yay! Oh. The similarities are frightening me now. They're I know, it started with Fantasia. It's scary. <laughs> Azure Twilight, stop following me! Oh, actually, I'm following her. The games, aren't I? Yeah. yeah. I don't think we ever explained why the fan there was a Fantasia reference to your real life, but I think we could skip over that. Yeah. <laughs> Sometime later, maybe in the future. <laughs> did we? Oh yeah, we did. I lost again. Arr. Arr. Of course you did. I'm not gonna let you win just because you're a pretty girl. I would. No. Actually, no, I wouldn't back then. No, no, you wouldn't. Have. Oh, you. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I held up on my own, thank you. I'm a gamer girl. Yeah, I learned that the hard way when we played Link for Swords. <laughs> okay, I quit. Tell me what happened. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. I guess I should have come clean about this. Well, before I saved Lee, I was a total mess. Almost abandoned school. I smoked. I didn't cut my hair. I fooled around with girls. All those horrible things. Wait, What? Didn't cut your hair? Smoking? That's the first thing she's concerned about. You didn't cut your hair? Excuse me, <laughs> we live in a traditionalist society here. I'm sorry, Neo. This just isn't going to work. I can't date a former hippie. <laughs> so cruel. You're so cruel to me. Besides, I'm trying to do a dramatic backstory reveal. Gosh, let him do it, guys! Yeah. I... Damn you, y'all took the Stop it! Damn it! <laughs> As I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know what to do with my life, so I thought I should just drown with it. But then I saved Lee. I was accepted into that family, and I felt like a tiny speck of dust there. Everyone was so strong, successful, brave. The Lee family was the epitome of high society, and I was a failure. I could see the arrows of their ways in handling doppelgangers, and I knew it was inhumane. I couldn't bring myself to agree with their methods. But compared to them, even Zuyan, I was a failure. Who's I to judge their ways was wrong? So I thought, I didn't have the right to tell them that they were wrong while I couldn't even prove myself. I tried and tried to change as hard as I could. I have this goal, to at least so wait, to be at least somebody, so I could stop doppelgangers. To reach that, I had to become a better person. So the result is what I am now. Not really awesome, but pretty good. Lies, you're awesome. Oh, oh my. I see. The reason why I want to work with you is... It's because we have the same eyes. Well, duh. Our children are going to have a, such amazing eyes. Oh, wait a second. This isn't because of some narcissistic desire to look into your own all the time, is it? <laughs> that's, that's funny. Uh, you have green eyes? Oh, I can't see you clearly behind those glasses. Back away, back away, you, you're you too close. Sorry. Stop it, senpai! No, well, you're not. now that you mention it, but that's not what I was originally talking about, I swear. We look forward. We're both chasing something out there to get ourselves approved by others. We're both trying to prove a point, even though we have to face death for it. I find that quality kind of... Awesome. Everything is awesome. Thank you, I guess. Besides, I have a thing for smart chicks. <laughs> smart. <laughs> I can't. No, it's okay. I'm just giggling. Yeah. I like looked up, but like I was just like smart chicks. Yeah, that sounds like. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know, me censor because I personally yeah. don't like swearing. Anyway, yeah, I don't blame you. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously, because smart people. Can you say that actually? Smart asses. Thank you. Think alike. It's better to have a partner who has the same view on those things, right? 
Oh, I'm confident. a resident swearer. <laughs> I'm confident you are. It's like decorating yourself. It's decorating. Like <laughs> your, it's like declaring yourself smart. Decorating yourself smart <laughs> to the Sims. <laughs> Sorry. See, that proved my point. I love smartasses. <laughs> so tell me, why did you wish to be like your sister? Huh? I told you my story. Now tell me yours. Whoop! Mm. You really want to know about everything, don't you? Well, I won't force you if you don't want to, but we're working together now, so we should know more about each other. I don't want to do something as low as a background check. Hmm. <sighs> it's all right. It's not like it's a secret or something. When Bertha died, my whole family was at a loss. There was no surprise since she was a picture. It was no since she was a picture of perfection. An energetic child, talented, smart. She won many awards at school. Track team, ridiculously high academic marks. Everyone loved her, especially mother and father. It felt like having her as a child was enough. But when she died, everything changed. It felt like everyone felt sorry for us. I saw how miserable everyone was. My parents were crushed. Why did she have to die? Why her? Why not Lucia? That's what everyone said to my parents. Cruel, isn't it? They actually said that? Mm-hmm. Lucia, this country is full of assholes. That really is. Actually, the funny thing is, is that that exact thing happened in Digimon Season 2. Mm -hmm. The hell? But yeah, I'll, I'll talk about it later. But it was merely the truth. Uh, they would be off, they would be better off without me. I'm the one who should have died that time instead. Technically, you're the one who killed her, so... I blame you for that when I found out. Blamed it. You blamed it. I'm sorry. Really, I'm so sorry. You don't have to apologize. Neil, I've forgiven you long ago, but... Everyone started to compare me to her, and so I developed some form of complex. I wanted to be just like her. My parents were in shock that they thought of me as her. They mistook me for her. They even called me by her name sometimes. I hated it. And so I tried to become her. But as you can see, I failed at it miserably. Funny, isn't it? I can't get good gr I can get good grades, but I suck at sports. Heck, I even failed at making making as many friends as her. Can't even get Senora view me the way he saw her. In the end, I'm just... me. <laughs> it's so pathetic. But what do I do? I'm going to keep trying until they can be proud of me the way they were proud of her. I just have to get rid of Lucia Nicole is all. Maybe the doppelganger was right, I thought. That's... That to fully become her, the real me can't exist. I wipe away the tears rolling up in my eyes, trying not to look so desperate. Are you going to get rid of your own existence to make your parents happy? Are you sure that's the only reason you did it? <laughs> I guess not. I just wanted everyone to view me like they viewed her. In order to be that way, I just have to become like her. Is that wrong, Neo? Yeah, in order for them to view you like her, you have to be her. It's the only way. See? It's right, isn't it? But I'll hate you. <laughs> what? If you get rid of who you are now, I'll hate you. Why would you? It's just how people view others is different. You can't make everyone like you, that's a fact. Are you willing to erase who you are just so everyone can view you as Bertha? Even if your parents are going to lose you, Lucia? Even if you're going to lose who you are? You'll let someone use Lucia's body to be Bertha and wait in the darkness? Is that what you really want? No one's going to lose anything if I'm gone. Everyone will be happy. My parents will have the child they wanted. Lucia will be loved by everybody. There'll be no bitchy girl anymore. No weak girl with no, who no one wants on their sports team anymore. 
Perfection. Just perfect, Lucia. I won't. Huh? I'm gonna lose the person standing in front of me now. To me, the person I've known these few weeks will be gone. It sounds a bit selfish, doesn't it? The you who pulled me back from my big breakdown will be gone. My partner in solving this case will be gone. The real Lucia Nicole will be gone. It's not just me. Everyone on the team will lose you. Your body will go back to where you think you belong. But each of us who knew who you really are won't be able to recognize you anymore. It'll be like we've never been part of your life. Because your life would be Bertha's. And it hurts, you know? To lose someone like that, and when you pass in front of me, I'll know it isn't you. Because I can't see you anymore. Because you are not you anymore. You promised to me, you know. And you have to keep your promise. That I'll stay by your side. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. Sorry, I'm overreacting. It really isn't my decision to begin with. But it would be nice. Huh? It would be nice to know that someone would miss me when I'm gone. It's really reassuring. <laughs> I... It was just my wish, you know? It doesn't mean I plan to die or something. I'll think of something to cancel my wish. Lucia. It's for this, right? The whole point of our date today, to save me from my doppelganger, isn't it? Shouldn't you be researching like you said? Yeah, I guess. Lucia, I need to tell you something. Your parents, they love you. It's been five years. They must have realized by now. Believe me, they are proud of you. Anyone would. When I spoke to your mother, she was really concerned about you. I promised I would protect you since you're a witness. So believe in them, like I believe in you. I'm sure that, like me, they don't want you to be replaced by a monster that came from hell, even though you would look like Bertha. Hmm. Don't worry, I'll help. Because I can't afford to lose my one and only partner. Right? Only? Huh. Right. <laughs> ah, girl. We leave and he drives me back without anything else. Without I... saying anything else. He looks lonely. I, I want my body to go back. Really, I do. If only I can manage to cancel my wish. Let's call it there! <laughs> oh my gosh. The feels. The feels. So many feels. All the feels. All the feels. Oh. All the feels he feels. Oh my gosh. <sighs> go find some warm drinks. Go wrap yourself in a sushi roll of a blanket. Go hug someone you love. Go hug someone you love. Find your favorite movie and or TV show. TV show. <laughs> just feel happiness, and we'll see you next time when we continue to just have you feel the feels. <laughs> Meanwhile, we'll continue to torture ourselves. <laughs> we get no like breaks. we always do. Yay! There's no breaks here. What's no. a break? I don't know. Phoenix Wright. That's a break. Uh, no, nope, that's not that's a break. Feels do. <laughs> At least this <laughs> child. <coughs> no, it's no, it's still feels for everybody. I know, but I mean mostly him because we know what's coming, so we can brace ourselves. <laughs> Anyway, thanks guys. Custom Robo. Let's just go watch our old Custom Robo videos. <laughs> a good series. You can go watch the lo the the lost the 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 nameless the, 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 the boys. Yes. Thank you. Name the yeah words. Nameless boys. Evil. The bathrooms. It's great. Beautiful. Yeah. Bathroom wrong. Anyway, farewell. Bye. 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 Bye.